Hey, what's up YouTube? It's Lee John Blackmore here, Super Easy Guitar. This week I'm going to do another tips lesson and this is how to have fun with the pentatonic scale. So, as you could see in the beginning, I've put together a really basic backing track. It took me like five minutes to do, guys, okay? Um, I'll put you a link for, so you can play along as well. So all I'm doing, I'm running through the pentatonic scale in the key of E and just messing around. It's just purely improvised, um, nothing special just to kind of have some fun with it okay so i want to teach you how to kind of do that as well all right so hopefully before you've watched this lesson you know how to play the pentatonic in the key of e so if we played it down in this position position one let me come up a bit closer so you can see what i'm doing so i'm just doing okay or starting from the sixth string o three O two, O two, O two, O three, O three. So that's position one in the pentatonic down here. So that sounds a little bit more interesting than just. So what I'm doing. So I'm just adding the occasional bend in there. Try it, third fret. So I'm just bending kind of up. You can use, you know, first, second finger, it doesn't really matter. Then you can hear me. I'm actually playing the top two strings and bending them together. And playing an open. Pull off there. Three, bend, O. Oh. Go to the next string. Three, O. Oh. Now your second fret on the third string. So bend up. Pull it back down. And then a pull off at the end. can finish it too on the D string. And I'm just ending with that bottom me. And you've got something that sounds kind of pretty cool, right? I'm just chucking that like Hendrix chord on at the end there, okay? So if anything you can play down here in the first position, like between the, the second and third fret, you can also do up here, right? On the twelfth fret. So now, instead of having the open, I have to have this twelfth fret. So I'm going 15, bend. You see how I use all three fingers to bend? This one's the most important one. It stays on the 12th fret. So I'm bending up these two. And when I take them off, I'm landing on that 12th fret. And I'm doing the same on the B string. So on the, on the G string, the third string, I'm now on uh, 12, 13, 14, okay? All three fingers down, bend, bend up, put it back down, and pull off. End it there on the 14th on the D string. It doesn't really matter, you know, in what order you do it. You know, I'm just purely just making it up as I'm going along, okay? It just beats the hell out of... I mean, that has its relevance as well, okay? So let's start off down here. But 
mean, you saw me kind of playing in the beginning. Playing through all these positions. So I'm going to show you kind of like a sliding technique to take you through all the separate positions. So the pentatonic's got five positions, right? That's why it's called, you know, the pentatonic, meaning five. So the first one's down here, right? And then the second one, you know, the third one, sorry, and then fourth, and the fifth. So you need to learn those positions first, but I'm going to show you a quick, easy way just to slide through them, okay? So follow me. It's going to start on the bottom E string, and we're going to end up on the top E string. So O on the bottom E string, 3, still on the bottom E, 5, slide 5 to 7. First finger then is going to play 5 on the A string. Then seven on the A string, now five on the D, seven on the D. Slide that to nine. Okay, so so far. Bottom E, O, three, five. Slide to seven. Next string, the A string, five, seven. Next string, the D string, five, seven, slide to nine. First finger, seven on the G string, nine, also on the G string. Now my first finger is going to hit eight on the B, okay, then ten. Also on the B, slide that to 12. First finger, now the top E string, 10. And then finish off 12. Also on the top E. So all together, O, 3, 5, slide to 7. Next string, 5, 7. Next string, 5, 7. Slide to 9. Next string, seven, nine. First finger is like a little shift then. It goes to eight, 10, slide to 12. First finger, 10, 12. Now I use slightly different fingers, but it'll only confuse you adding this second finger. So just keep it simple for now. So we've got three things we can do so far, right? The first one. The second one. Now the third one. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to put the backing track on and I'm just going to show you how to play, to start to play along with the backing track, all right? So let's have a quick listen. So let's start off with a nice easy one here. So there's our first one. Next one. Okay, so something like that, okay? Just make it up as you go along, just using those notes. I'm trying to keep it nice and simple here, alright? Then we're going to use the sliding scale, ready? So hopefully 
hopefully this will help you out, guys. Um, play around with it. Have fun with it. You know, it's we call it improvising. You know, there's no right or wrong. Um, it's kind of just really getting to know this, the pentatonic scale in a way where you're not just playing it, you know, from start to finish all the time. You're getting so used to it, and then you can kind of add like the fun licks in between. Where you know, just start off with some nice easy bends. <laughs> doesn't have to be much or, or some hammer on pull offs. Leave your finger on the 12th, hammer down on the 15th and pull back off. Do it on all the strings. Obviously I'm going down the scale. Okay, so there's all sorts of stuff you can do. Just the main thing is kind of experiment, have fun with it. There's tons and tons of backing tracks online. Okay, so there you have it, guys. Just something extra to do with the pentatonic scale. I've put the link for the backing track below. Please give me the thumbs up and subscribe. I really, really appreciate that. I love all the comments you send me. Obviously, I can't do all the requests you send me, but I'll do my best, okay? Um, let me know how you get on in the comments box below. I love to hear from you guys, alright? And I'll see you the same time next week. Enjoy! <laughs>